aren't you tired of being single and lonely every day and aren't you tired of being near me to the to the hub and to the online girls e-girls who don't even know you exist every day and aren't you tired of looking at girls on instagram who don't even know you exist and aren't you tired of being so obsessed with your crush who doesn't even know you exist and aren't you tired of texting girls and calling them calling girls who don't recipro reciprocate the same energy in return and if you answer yes to any of these questions then this video is indeed for you so the reason i don't talk about dating in this channel is mainly because i don't want to lead y'all astray and i don't want to lead y'all astray with, with any bad advice i put it to y'all ears and what i feed y'all and i don't want to want to put y'all in bad situations either when it comes to relationships and the truth is i don't want to give y'all my best and i don't want and the truth also want god's best also and the reason i don't talk about dating this channel is because me per personally i prefer to stay single and romance is not really the top of my priority right right now right now i'm mainly focused on building building the kingdom be the kingdom of god i mainly focus my relationship with the most i um, focus for this channel and i focus on serving others and any outside of that is not really important and yes family is important too that's true and don't get me wrong i do admire romance and dating from a distance and one of the things, things i do love about about it is that when it comes to romance is that no matter what what challenges the stumble stumbling blocks comes comes to the couple's way they always find a way to make it work. They always find a way to work through those challenges and stay together. That's one of the things I do love about romance and dating. And it's honestly, it's sad you don't you don't see much of that nowadays. Days because nowadays relationships are transactional. I know I know it hurts, but it's the truth. And this video is not only for for y'all, but this is for my younger self. And. If you plan on getting into a relationship, make sure y'all stay focused on the most side. Make sure you have a personal relationship with the most side. And make sure you, you're showing that person person love, love, respect, and and make sure you set boundaries. And also, make sure y'all pray for each other. That's one of the things I do recommend if y'all were to ever get, get into a relationship. But, anyway. But... I'm here to, here to talk about about being single, mainly. And I know it's it sucks not having someone by your side. It's it's really tough, honestly. And and yes, I do have my challenges here and there for being single, but the thing is, I don't let it, I don't let it get to me. But I'm here to tell you something. The reason you're struggling you're struggling so much with being single. And the reason being is that you expect, expect another human being to satisfy your heart. And then it, and how do you do this? You Let's say, for y'all men, let's say you do nice things for a woman, yet you expect something in return. You expect that love, validation, and need in return. But guess what? That woman doesn't give it to you. And... Uh, Probably because he didn't he didn't tell her that he wanted a relationship with her, but hey, that that's on you. Or if and don't get me wrong, if she reciprocates, hey, cool. But if you're if you're constantly looking here for her to give that love you're craving, then I even if you to get it, you still be looking for the next thing. Your heart would still not be satisfied. It would it still wouldn't be enough. And that's why cheating, cheating even happens in your relationships because the man and the woman, the human beings always look, humans, we, us humans are always looking for the next thing, always L looking for the next thing that is like, exciting, that's intriguing, that's very interesting. And uh, even, even we, we should jump from relationship to relationship, it's not going to satisfy the human heart. And no matter how much that person loves you, and no matter matter how much you love that person, it's not gonna it's not gonna fill that hole you have in your heart. It's not gonna satisfy that craving you have in your heart. Your heart is still longing for something. 
And the thing is, I'm here to here to provide y'all a solution. And that and that's the Lord Jesus Christ. The only the only person in this, in this world who could fill that hole, that void in your heart, is Jesus Christ. Yes, I'm talking about the one who has who has shown unconditional love towards humanity. humanity. And I'm talking about by the by the Son of the Most High, the Messiah, who came to become a sacrificial lamb for all the humanity, so that they want to suffer eternal punishment, but they can have eternal life in heaven and live a life of purpose, and, purpose and fulfillment here on earth. And Jesus, Jesus is, is the one is is the one that can fill that hole in your heart, because the thing is that we expect we expect other people's love to be 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 lasting forever but in a world we but because we live in a civil world the love the type of love we give is conditional and when someone messes up someone screws up then they stop loving you and 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 it does it, and it does something to us and it breaks and breaks our hearts and and that's how people people become bitter and sinful and sinful in this world, because they're always look, looking for, looking for something to fill that hole in their heart. And I'm here to tell you that only Jesus Christ could do that. The that love you're looking for, Jesus has that kind of love. That the heavenly Father, Father has that kind of love love for you. And how and you're wondering. How can how can you how can you can you get this love you're craving in your heart? You need to come to the Lord Jesus Christ in faith and place your faith and trust in him for, for your life. For your life. Give your life to Jesus and have a personal relationship with him. And when when you spend and as you continue to spend time with him, you're not gonna you're not gonna look to look to other girls or other boys for to, to satisfy your human heart. You're gonna to look to Christ, Christ Jesus, to Christ Jesus, to the one who has whose love is everlasting. And I, I can tell you, I can tell you my testimony. I used, I, I used to look, look to other people for for love. And there was this girl in high school, in middle school, I used to be so obsessed with, and always trying to get her attention, always trying to, trying to get something back from her. And I wasted three years of my life doing that, part or two years, and I got nothing. And I became a very bitter, resentful person because I didn't get something, get it, get what I wanted. It wasn't until one day I gave my life to Jesus, and when I moved on for that, is when, is when, when I experienced the true love in my life. Jesus, Jesus Christ is true love, true love, and. He, when when I gave my life life to him, it was like my life was never the same. And I felt more love, joy, peace as I had a relationship with him. With him. It is one of the best decisions I made in my life. And if he could do that for me, me, he could do that for you. Stop pestilizing people. Stop looking for other people to fill that void in your heart because it's not gonna it's not gonna work. It won't. Only Jesus Christ can fill that void in your heart. If only you come to him in faith and spend some time with him by prayer, fasting, worship, and reading the word of God. Which I'll go over the next another time. Anyway, those are so those are my views on dating and that's and that's why I'm single. And that's and that's a little bit of what what you want to know about me. And getting to know me and being real for y'all. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on notification for future videos. I do pray this video helps anyone give your life to Jesus and stop looking for other people to fill that void in their hearts and look to the Lord Jesus Christ who could, who could fill their heart with, with everlasting love. Till then, don't be religious, follow Christ.